Do you have work or you don't have work? I don't have work. Oh, okay. So, um, I forgot that I have to take care of Elena. Oh, and perfect. she's coming at twelve. Oh, perfect. and that's thirty minutes from right now. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Great timing. Anyways, this is my cousin Sonia. Hi. Where am I going? So we're going to Seven Eleven. I'm doing eating Seven uh, Eleven food for twenty four hours, but you're not. Okay. Okay. Just, <laughs> this is just the morning. Um. Mm, yeah. a little, little breakfast. A little bre breakfast. Yeah. I called this girl and she was sleeping. It was 11 to bed. I'm getting on my studio, Sarah. What do you mean? Like, I hadn't done my assignments for like two weeks. Oh, shit. Sure. Yeah. 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 You were still in your spring break. Yeah. I'm in my spring break a little longer. So that's what I was doing last night. Okay. What is it? Dinamita? 
Yeah. The bags? Yeah, that they look different? Yeah. I agree with him. They taste different and they look different. They look different for sure. So, this is gonna be my life for all day today. How exciting. All right. We got 20 minutes. To get home too. Yep. <laughs> Hmm, she looks good for dinner. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna get like that over there. Uh, not sure. These are the stickies. Um, I don't think I do. Okay. I need a drink. <laughs> Lemonade, alright. Mm. Mm. Happy birthday. The hot plate. It will not the tongue. What if I want to sell them? Echate una I'm gonna go ahead and get this. <gasps> Another one? No, get over it. I was just kidding. Oh, okay. I thought you were being serious. No. <laughs> Alright, now we gotta race back home because my niece is probably going to be there by the time I arrive. Right, um, my brother probably has already texted me. Yeah, ladies first. Why do you want to leave when I literally you saw me getting in my car? This one's, I don't even know, I couldn't even tell you. Again, mm -hmm. the same thing all over. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't even know what I taste. I see chicken. Mm -hmm. They bud. Mm -hmm. So good. Mm. We're also not driving. I arrived to my house, so don't think I'm just driving around with my niece with no portale. You didn't like it? No, it was like a little piece of like whatever vegetable. Okay, no worries. It was like no worries. I have to take it off so it's not in the way. Last one. You just scared me with that face. All I taste is the bread. I taste frijoles. What? Yoga back there, Mama. Mm. As 
always your classic. Interesting breakfast meal, but I don't mind it. My breakfast too. Even though I've been awake since like seven in the morning, this is my first meal. That's when you fell asleep? No, uh, I'm lying because mm. I woke up super late. I thought you, were, you fell asleep that time because mm -mm. you were studying. Mm -mm. I would never. I'm not that serious. Una desvelada por estudiar? Nunca. No. Jamás. Jamás. Have you told YouTube about Mexico? Have not. Bro, I went to Mexico. Thank you. Oh my god, that's such like a great topic. I went to Mexico for spring break and I had a really fun time. Going to Mexico is just always so relaxing to me. And then I come back here and it's like reality and it's like disgusting. And then you like overthink of your life like when you're here and when you're over there, you, you forget that you have a life here. You forget that you have to work, you forget that you have to study. Like you're just there in Mexico like living life. <sighs> I also have cousins my age over there. And they're super funny and fun to hang out with. So I was kind of sad coming back here but it is what it is. Mexico will forever be my happy place. And that is that. We'll be back soon. Yes, we'll be back soon, hopefully. That's why I was trying to live it to the fullest. Because I'm like, I don't know if this is going to be the last time I come to Mexico. Because something can happen. I just wish, like, you could go both ways. Like, honestly, I feel so bad for my, my family members mm -hmm. that they can't come over here. And it feels guilty because we can do both. Right. And then they follow me on social media and I feel like they think that I might be a bragger. But, like, they don't understand. Like, I am not rich over here. I might seem rich over there, but here, the, the situation is different. Like, we were, both of us were, like, raised in, like, less than, I feel like less than middle class. For sure. For sure. But they don't see that. And I don't want to make it seem like I'm bragging that I have it all. I'm like, this This that you see right here, I owe it all. I owe it all. It's not even mine. <laughs> yeah, but when you go to Mexico, it's una reflexión en tu vida. Y que tienes que valorar todo lo que te da. And, yeah. You also appreciate your parents more after it. Yeah, I'm like... Well, if my parents wouldn't have, like, um, immigrated, I wouldn't even be here. Because my parents didn't meet in Mexico. They met in Jersey. Yours met in Mexico, right? Mm hmm So you. I would have been you living would be the life over there. Yeah. I would have been down at my grandma's house. <laughs> no, thank you. Mm -hmm. No, thank you. I think I'm too... I, th I don't think I'm built for that. Mm -hmm. I don't think I was raised here for that. Well, chicken chases me and I'm out. God knew I'm that we done. were a little pussies. No, <laughs> yeah. <I'm> just... <laughs> Are you wrong? <laughs> um, yeah. So, beyond blessed that we can go both ways to visit our family over there and have a life over here. The music. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm so glad we're like close. Like our family. No, literally. I know so many people that they're like, that's your cousin? Like, you like hug your cousins? I'm like, yes. I'll give them a kiss on the cheek if yeah. I could. I do. I do. No, thank you. I do it to Lisa, and Lisa's like, <laughs> I do. I'm a very, like, loving, like, physical touch person. So I'm just like, oh my gosh, I haven't seen you in forever. Yeah. That's like us with our cousins. We're like this. Ever since we were little. The, the crazy when we were like I was gonna say the craziest part is that me and her hate like not hated each other but we'd always be bumping Beating. heads like, it was always and it was only just me and her it would be like <laughs> no but I feel like they did that on purpose like, oh, they, were, they, were, they were they wanted some yeah, action they were like oh like she said this uh -huh. and, and so she like, did what are you that. gonna do about it and I was like, like oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> 
I remember one time we were fighting in my cousin's Johnny and Joanny's room. Mm -hmm. And I, I remember that so vividly. Me too. I had a One Direction pink shirt with their like um like shadows and they they were like uh like black shadows they didn't show like their faces or anything it was a tank top too so. no it wasn't yeah. it, it was like a shirt and it went like you made it look like a tank top <laughs> this girl pulls me she goes boom <laughs> and then <laughs> i seen that she did that and i was like stop stop my one direction shirt you ruined it and I remember crying because she ruined my wonder. <laughs> you went outside and told your mom. Yeah. I was like, Mom! And, um, was like, and then I never got another One Direction shirt. Which my mom told me that's why she never, she stopped letting me sleep over. Boy, that's Cap. They just found excuses not to let you. No, she said it's because me and you were always fighting. Wow. I want my child to be this calm. What happened? Oh my gosh. I'm like, video's over. My baby's sad. Cut. What, mama? You want to go inside? You want to go see the chickens? Okay, let's go see the chickens. So now I am going to work. If I'm being honest with you, I'm lucky if I get two meals in like a day. So this is gonna have me set for like the whole day. I feel like if you work in like a, the restaurant industry, you don't really get breaks. Well, at least at my restaurant, like you don't have a break. And then I'm also a hostess, so I'm at the front the whole time. And we recently got in trouble for drinking water up there, so. Um, anyways, let's go to the 7-Eleven. Okay, I'm here. I always get embarrassed, like, carrying my phone like this. It's just embarrassing to me. <sighs> but it's okay. I need to suck it up. I need to suck it up. sticking to my slurpee and my pickles all right i'll see you at work since i can't eat my salad and y'all came to watch me eat Me estoy convirtiendo en un, en un anosabo, así que creo que voy a hacer un video hablando en español por 24 horas. I went to Mexico, like I said previously in the video, and when I go to Mexico, I feel like such an anosabo because like the Spanish that my cousins and family members grew up with over there is like obviously all they know. So I feel like I don't know English and I don't know Spanish at the same time. Like, I feel like I know 75% of each language, not 100% of either, so. Um, that is the story of my life. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wow. I'm at work now. I don't wanna be here right now. Okay. Peace out, Girl Scout. I'll show y'all me eating. I'll show you. I sh I'll show y'all eating. I'll show y'all me. I'll show me inside eating. <laughs> That's embarrassing. What is going on? Why is everybody in like their regular clothes? Because they were all required to be here. Because the menu's changed. 
So even if you're even if you're off. Yeah. Okay, no worries, thank you so much. One thing I wanted to do is cut me off here with mint cinnamon because I was still talking. So I did that. Hey, thank you so much. Oh, so scary. Is it? <laughs> and I'm like shaking. I'm like <laughs> And then me like Yeah, I'm like <laughs> Shut up. Do it the salad from here. I need a good angle. How many guests? Are you? Let's go on the ride. It's literally a day and I said it was a 4 out of 10. 